sun is shining, the snow is melting, spring is on its way. The appropriate time to wear shorts to school is coming up. Oh man. What did you just say? Spring is on its way. Sadie, there's five more weeks of winter left. No! Hi Wheat North, this is Sadie Chelson with your Falcon Weekly for Friday, February 10th. Are you interested in participating in the Spring Musical? Come to the info meeting Monday, February 13th after school in the auditorium to find out more. Join the theater classroom for more information. Students, do one of your teachers go above and beyond to help you learn? You may have noticed at the lunch tables a promotional flyer and QR code or on your graduating class Google Classroom page to nominate teachers who show heart. Helpful, engaging, accessible, relevant, and teaching. Your nomination can remain anonymous and can be for a teacher from last semester or this current semester. The deadline to nominate is by the end of the school today. Your nominated teachers will be rewarded on Valentine's Day. The Smile Squad will be at Wheaton North on March 22, 2023. If you are in need of dental work, free of charge, please visit the health office to pick up information. Are you looking for an after school or summer internship? Are you 16 years old and interested in getting paid 12 to 14 an hour in either manufacturing, informational technology? If so, please scan this QR code or fill out the interest survey located at the bottom of the Wheaton North High School Student Life website. Please see Mr. Vankus in the main office or your counselor if you have any questions. And now, here's your Falcon Sports Update. Hey Falcons, this is Charlie Marconi with your sports update. Winter Guard came first out of 11 SRA guards. They improved their score from last week to a 53.83. They came first in all captain awards and second in equipment. The rifle quartet included Sam Hagen, Sonia Gill, Asha Garcia, and Alanya Shoemaker. They showed great improvement from last week. Congrats on a fantastic performance. The girls basketball team had a close victory over Glenbard North last Thursday with a final score of 53 to 50. They also played St. Charles East on Tuesday and defeated them 51-41 in a tough fought game. The girls' next basketball game is at Willowbrook at 7.30. Come out to support the girls. The boys' basketball team had a heartbreaking defeat to South with a score of 50-33. Their next game is at St. Charles East at 7 o'clock on February 15th. Five varsity wrestlers advanced to this week's sectionals at Conant High School. They are Mikey Rosh, Eli Cook, Devin Medina, Sam Lemp, and David Hyde. Congratulations to all of them who came up in the top three spots. The Wheaton North cheerleading team ended their season last weekend in the first round of state meet in Bloomington. They competed and finished in the top 20. Congratulations to the cheer team for their hard work, their hard work throughout the season and making it to state in the process. Girls track and field has their first meet this Saturday. They're hosting in the field house at 9 a.m. and hope to see you there. Good luck, girls. The boys track and field team had their first meet last night in the field house. It was a great start to the season. They will travel to the Wheaton Warrenville South invite next Friday at 5 p.m. Boys gymnastics starts this Monday. Their first meet is March 1st. Keep, this, keep that evening open to go to support them because it's coming up fast. The girls gymnastics qualified for sectionals this week where they, competed, they compete on Monday. They did a great job and several members of the team were individual state qualifiers. They will spend the next few weeks preparing to travel to state in March. Congratulations and good luck.
This has been Charlie Marconi with your sports update. See you next time, Falcons. Open gyms for boys volleyball have begun. They are open to anyone interested in trying out for boys volleyball on March 6th, 7th, and 8th. The next open gym is Wednesday, February 15th, 4.30 to 5.30 p.m. in the Nebs Gym. See Coach No or Coach Heinemann with any questions. All girls interested in trying out for soccer are asked to attend the mandatory informational meeting in room 905 on Wednesday, February 14th at 225. If you have any conflicts, see Coach McEvely in the room prior to the meeting. Interested in playing softball for the Falcons? Come to the next open gym on February 14th or Thursday, February 16th from 4.30 to 6 in the Fieldhouse. Bring your glove! Any questions, reach out to Coach Revanesi. Attention Falcon badminton players. There are just two open gyms left before tryouts on February 15th and Thursday, February 23rd. Both are 6.30 to 8. Tryouts start Monday, February 27th at 7 to 8.30 p.m. in the Fieldhouse. Any questions, ask Coach Wegman or Coach Alberg. Seniors, the scholarship bullet bulletin, updated monthly, has great scholarships for you to apply for. The local scholarship application is also available. You can apply for 12 scholarships using one application. The deadline is February 22nd, 2023, so fill out your applications today. You can find the application on the monthly scholarship bulletin or in your counselor's Google Classroom. Congratulations to the speech team. The team qualified 10 of 15 events to sexuals, including Emily Peterson, Ella Hiles, Hannah Julian, Sophia Spillane, and the cast of the performance in the round. Also advancing are regional champions, Annie Sullivan, Nee Dow, Karina Rodriguez, and Christian Joyce Lopez. Wish the team luck as they compete at the sectionals tournament tomorrow at Wheaton Warrenville South. This has been Sadie Chelson. Enjoy your weekend, Falcons.